had I just been somebody thrown in Starliner, I don't think he could have controlled it. But because I had lived it for so long and I'd lived over mechanics going all the way back to my shuttle training for decades and I had the presence of mind and the, and the you know, it's a, a calmness come over. If you We call it snakes in the cockpit. You can't get ruffled in the cockpit mm-hmm. like snakes, fighting off snakes. No. You can't let that happen. You have to maintain a demeanor so you can do what's necessary. And, and that ability was goes back to my Navy days flying off aircraft carriers and landing on the boat at night and in combat and dodging missiles and anti-aircraft artillery and all that. So it was all that Lord's providential direction of things that put in that moment calmness and contentment, understand he's in control, understanding what the possibilities might be, understanding that he's my Lord and Savior, he's forgiven me my sin because he paid the price for my sin on the cross. If he takes me now, so be it. All of that's going through my mind while I'm trying to control because I don't want to not make it. Yeah. We have to dock, and the only way we can get there is if I can control the spacecraft long enough for us to get the capability back so we can dock. 